Hello YouTube, we're back. Joel and Sean in the garage with this little old girl. Today, we're gonna see if we can get her started. Oh, we get her started. Really? Yeah. Don't you get it? No, I got the one from the 800s instead. Yeah. Oh, really? 20 bucks cheaper. Oh, it's like... It's, it's got, okay. probably has more cold cranking amps, too. Yeah, and it was covered. The other one was... No, it's isolated. The other one was not isolated. It was like the one to... Oh, it's like screwing. So I guess that's why it's more expensive because it's an older one. You should. So I was like, eh... Uh, <laughs> Well, it looks like the little green thing's right. Green thing. It's right there in the front. Let's get that shitty oil out of there first. You said three quarts, right? Yeah, it said, well, it said like 3.2, but uh, to get it going. Yeah. Oh, good. How much in? Professional. Professional results. Of course, the stupid pulls right now. It's not that far away. Yeah. Ten minutes, so. Got my wall at. Is there anything else we can come up with that we need? Get another quart of oil. So I have. Yeah, it wouldn't hurt yeah. to have it. I'll be back. We need an inline fuel filter for, I would assume it's a probably a quarter inch, but it's just like a little. Yeah, it's you like know what you want to have on the moped. Yeah, yeah, same thing. Yeah. I'll be back. Call, right. me, call me if you come up with something. Alright. Alright, guys, so so far, got it torn down, got the tank off. We, uh, figured out the fuse that the previous owner was speaking of. Um, it was on this side here, this fuse. Come off little buddy. This 30 was popped. Got a little bit of corrosion in there. We'll clean that up later with a brush. So hopefully that was the reason I guess I could always hook the battery up 
and see if we get power. But I'll wait till Joel gets back. Oh, it's you. All right. I'm trying to free this little end of the fuel filter so we can get the new one in. Yeah. Trash. Yeah. <laughs> All we have to do is see if it runs, and then we can tear it up completely apart, take the motor out, clean the frame, repaint it, chop shit off the frame that we don't want on the frame, and uh, get moving. Got that little plastic piece from the fuel footer out. And uh, what I was talking about before, my camera flipped upside down, because I forgot my tripod again was we want to make sure it runs uh we just put fresh oil in it uh found the blown fuse we're gonna hook the battery up get some fuel in it make sure it runs and then we'll clean everything up strip the frame cut things off the frame that joel doesn't want on here like we're gonna probably bob this tail end get rid of this passenger peg nonsense here clean up some stuff maybe uh solidify some stuff make it a little bit more rigid get these ugly squares off the back. Do something a little cleaner in the back end here. Clean it up, freshen up the frame, paint it, clean the motor up, polish things. He might want to go black with the right. motor. Put the back part of the intake box off. Battery box is in the way. Let's take a look at this filter. Nice. Joel, look at your Awesome filter, huh? Oh, what you got? Goodies? Goodies. Fuel filter. Nice. And some more oil. All right. The, all this stuff off the side here, yeah. just to try and get a look at how we can get this thing out of here. It looks like we're possibly gonna have to take the battery, battery, the battery box out mm -hmm. to get this side off. All right, well, let's deal with that later. Let's get the battery hooked up and get all these cables hooked back up and see if we can get this fucking thing kicked, or not kicked over, but started. All right, so this goes. What the fuck? You do the honors, bro. It's your bike. Crank it over like two times with the throttle to try and get some fuel down in there. I'll just put it on reserve. On reserve? Yeah. One. I doubt we're going to have any fuel because we don't have any fuel in, fuel in the tank. Let's see if it cranks over. It sounds healthy, dude. Oh, yeah. We just need gas. <laughs> Fuel anywhere. Nope. 
fuel on. Fuel filter's filling up. Hell yeah, dude. Man. It's always good to have gas laying around. Ignition off. Yep, yeah. red uh, button down. It's on. Give it a couple crank overs. Yeah, let it uh, try and start it. Okay. All right, we'll try it with the choke. Trying again. It's been a while. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. And again. All right, we have to let it warm up a little bit. Go ahead again. We got, what do we do, Joel? We got oil. Yeah, oil. And uh, we got some stuff off the bike that we didn't want to have there. And uh, new battery. New battery. Um, new gas filter. Yeah, new fuel filter. Replaced the 30 amp fuse. And really, that's it. I mean, it started right up. She cracked right up. It sounds pretty good, too. So, uh, I think we got ourselves a healthy runner. We're just got to do all the regular maintenance stuff, fork seals, and then everything else is cosmetic, really. Electronics need to be cleaned up a little bit. And uh, now the fun start begins because we know it runs. We just have to adjust carbs and, and do all the, make it look cool. Um, how do you feel? Yeah, I feel great. Uh, you have yeah, to feel great. That's like, amazing. Dude, do, we, do you want to tell them how much you paid for this thing? Keep Look, a secret. this was a steal, right? Yeah, yeah we for, still for a runner that really, I mean, knowing now that it runs and how well it's running with a carb, a carb tune, a new tube in the rear tire, and we'll freshen up the brakes and stuff like that. I mean, what a steal. You don't get a running bike for next to nothing anymore. You don't, no, get, ne no. you don't get anything that runs no. for next to nothing anymore, so... I'm stoked for you, dude. Yep. This is awesome. Uh, we're happy. Happy, yeah. happy. So now we just get to do the fun stuff. Yep. So stay tuned, guys. We got the Ripper ripping. And uh, I think by next time, we'll have a bunch of stuff probably cut off of it. Yep. And, uh, man. Stuff to try on. Yeah. New stuff on, old stuff off. So stay tuned. What do you got to say? Well, see you next time. All right. Don't forget to subscribe. That's right. Like and subscribe, please. Really appreciate it. Have a good night.